For really cheap games, I urge you guys to go check out G2A.com. The links are in the description. Okay, hey guys, what is going on? My name is Otis Zonda and welcome to a final review uh, of the Rocat Cone XTD as well as the Siru Razor Sharp Edge Knife Edge Fin Super Duper Mouse Map. Now basically that's what I'm going to call it. It's basically, you may notice it's actually really impossible to pick up. It's actually ridiculously thin, but it's also really, really good. And very hard to move once it's actually on the surface as well, which is very, very nice. But it actually works perfectly with the Rocat Cone, and it literally glides across that. I've used another mouse on it, it doesn't, it, it feels a little bit scratchy, but on the Rocat Cone, it literally glides, but you actually do get that precision movement as well. It's very, very nice. I like that a lot. I like that a lot. So basically right here, this right here is the Rocat Cone, uh, the Cone XD, which is the newest version. I have re reviewed the first Rocat Cone, but this is the XD. I believe there's been a couple ones since then, like the Plus as well. But uh, basically, this one here, I've already done. I've already done an unboxing and everything, and kind of told you guys about uh, the actual things that you get with it. Uh, obviously, it has its easy shift button. It has uh, an integrated TDCU. Has its four light LED uh, light system, which obviously uh, you can change there. So you can change obviously the two colors and then two colors at the back, and it kind of fades into one in the middle. It's very very nice. It has a 32 bit 72 megahertz Turbo V2 processor. Uh, obviously, you have your DPI up and down buttons just there. Uh, yeah, it has a tough uh, wheel, uh, which is actually a 4D built wheel, so they call it, uh, which basically means you have your scroll forward, you scroll backwards, you have your click in, and you also have your left and right movement there. So you actually have uh, basically two, three buttons, and obviously a scroll forward and back uh, scroll there, actually just on the scroll wheel itself, which is very, very nice. Oh, it obviously comes with a lovely braided cable, as uh, you, that is something that you definitely need. Uh, it, underneath, it has four easy clip in weights, uh, which obviously make it very. Very adjustable because some people like a light mouse, I like a heavy mouse, so I've got all four weights in there like so. Um, it also has uh, 576 kilobytes onboard memory, uh, which basically manages, uh, which obviously you can store like your macros and your settings and stuff. Uh, what else, what else, what else, what else, what else? Um, it, uh, basically, uh, what, what Rocat says, uh, they basically claim that there's something that they claim with their clicks, uh, their product, is they have uh, what they call the Clickmaster, which is basically uh, Swift Tech powered by Omron, which is basically the, uh, obviously the clicks and stuff, um, but obviously it is a very, very nice mouse. It's got a lovely feel. It's got like a matte kind of rubberized textured feel all over it. It's very, very nice indeed. Uh, obviously, it has the Rocat Easy Shift, um, which is... Um, basically allows you to kind of switch between uh, kind of different buttons and stuff so as you hold down the shift button uh, you can actually uh, basically opens up a kind of whole load of new buttons if you get what I mean so whilst holding down the shift button you would use another button that would normally be one thing you can set it as a macro to something else which is very very nice as well obviously it also has the Rocat talk feature so if you have something like a Rocat Isku keyboard or something like that as well you can actually combine the two and basically macro them to different kind of settings on different things so they kind of talk to each other and work together so to speak which is a very very nice feature and something I love about the Rocat mouse uh, mice and stuff. Obviously this does come with um this does come with obviously the uh the Rocat uh, software where basically you can change all your DPI settings, set loads of different macros, set all your different DPI settings that you want to set the difference, obviously your different stages. Uh, I believe it has six different ones available just on the mouse alone, I'm not too sure, can't remember now actually. And it also has an 8,200 DPI laser, which obviously is pretty damn insane because if anybody needs more than 8,200 DPI, that is a ridiculously high DPI. And that thing literally, look, uh, in fact, if I set it as high as it goes, I literally, that is the movement I have to do, and it goes all the way from the left side of my mouse, like the left side of the screen, to my right side, and that's not even like normal screens, that's across my triple screens. So on an 8000 DPI, I'm literally moving that much to move all the way across from my triple screens, which is absolutely crazy. I would never use that high DPI, but if that's something you guys use, and you're literally that skilled of a mouse, and that precision, that's something you can go for. Fair enough, I'm not going to argue. But overall, guys, this really is one hell of a mouse. It's very, very nice and works really, really well with this Rocat Siri mousepad, man. This mousepad is very, very nice. Obviously, very robust and kind of something that's going to last a while because obviously it's so thin and it's actually very, very nice. So, I want to say thank you very much, guys. I hope you guys have enjoyed this video. My name is LC Zonda, as per usual. Thank you very much. I will see you beautiful people next time. Thank you very much. Peace out and goodbye.